Hello yo lot, how am ya? Welcome to the Looney Live. I know it's been a while since I've done a try on all um, because I've been focusing on the podcast and my other content. It's been really difficult to just make time to do try on hauls but anyway I'm here today. Um, I have some new autumn clothes to show you and then I'm also going to use like some of my older clothes and do some layering and stuff today. We'll do a little bit of a catwalk thing as I normally do and yeah it's just gonna be the usual wild try on all with me um if you would like more content like this i have passes where i do try on hauls and photos then obviously if you prefer my asmr content i'm over on patreon where i do asmr videos weekly extra ones uh, and you get early access to my youtube content as well okay enough of my rambling don't forget to check out the podcast thank you and it is time to start wrapping up it is getting cold unless unless you're nick and still wearing strap tops you'll see in the podcast it was absolutely freezing i was wrapped up in like woolly jumpers she was there in a strap top freezing today it's not so bad it's a little bit warmer but tonight i know for a fact it's gonna be cold so we're gonna get ready for the cold weather the first outfit Oh, I've got suitcases here. Right, I'm going to move these suitcases. They should be up the loft, but we're lazy. Um, and then I'll get started. And coming up with the first item is Jodie Marie. <laughs> Why am I introducing myself? <laughs> well, anyway. You've seen this shirt before, but the dress you haven't, and I'll take it off here in a sec. The shirt, not the dress. The shirt's from Next, I had it a, a while ago. Uh, oh, was it Marx's actually? And the dress is new from Sheen. So, you've probably seen the grey one that I matched with the jumper. Marks and Spencer's this is. I've got like three conversations going on in my head right now. Right, start again. Um, this dress is from Sheen. I bought it just recently because you've probably seen the grey one that I match with the jumper. Well I thought if I get a couple of them then it don't look like I'm wearing the same thing all the time because I do just wear the same things all the time. So I thought if I buy more of the things I like then I can like swap and change and I'm not going to be thinking too much about what I'm wearing because I find that's the most difficult part of getting up for me in the morning. I don't know what to wear. I've got rooks loads of clothes and then I look at them and I'm like I've got too much choice <laughs> so we're limiting options now okay we're in a new era right jumper i had a pink one of these i can't find it i was telling my um passes fans earlier that i got a pink one and then i was looking for it for this video and I can't find it because I thought the light pink and the bright pink would work quite nicely. But I can't find it. I can't even find the grey dress. So it's a good job I bought these. I don't know where I put them. I don't think I've stayed anywhere either that I might have left them. Okay, first dress. What do you think? I don't know if the cream goes with the pink. I'm not sure now. I tried it on earlier and I was like, oh, it's cute, but now I'm not sure again, you know. It's the different lightings. Anyway, next one. I'm just prancing about. <laughs> A Disney Channel special where you put the jumper under the dress. <laughs> I did just do this for jokes. It's still cute anyway. <laughs> it actually is. It's like a dungaree dress. Nah, just kidding. Right, next one. This is the blue one. Still got the tags on. Oh, it's inside. It's there anyway. From Sheen. It's cute. Uh, this one might look better with a blue, the cream jumper. Oh, yeah, I've got a black jumper as well. I'll show you them all. Oh, 
Oh yeah, this is cute. I just feel really cute. I think it must be the fringe and the jumpers. I just, I'm out my own heart. <laughs> Yeah, I think the black jumper is definitely going to work better with the pink dress. Although it still works nice with the blue as well. What do you think? And this can go with the grey one I've got if I ever find it. I love this coat dress, I do. I think this was from Loins. I can't remember, it was sent from someone, but it was like not last year, maybe the year before. But it's still lovely. I just feel really smart, but also very classy and cute, you know. Really love this one. I need more clothes like this. No, I don't. <laughs> it's rare you see them though, and then when you get them, they don't fit the same. This was just lucky, I think. You never really see them like in stores. It's always online that you get like more creative and pretty fashion, I feel like. And then when you get it, it's not what you expected. But this is cute. This is definitely an old but gold. This one's really comfortable, it's really quick. I don't have to think too much about it because it's just a dress and I can just put any shoes with it. It's a long sleeve, it fastens at the back, I can never fit the button myself. Well I probably could if I tried, but I ain't tried. I'm talking extra fast today. I'm not, I've not sped this up. <laughs> this is just where I am today. <laughs> This is well, I like this though. I'm a fan of floral stuff. My friends take the piss out of me for it, but it's really pretty. The navy and the pinks. You can't tell me it's not gorgeous. Same jumper from Sheen. But the cargoes are from JD. I went to JD to get some joggers with zips. Do you think I could find any? I had to get men's. So that's why they look all baggy in the videos if you've seen them of me at Ninja Warrior and Rush. So we went to a trampoline place. I'll tell you all about it. Anyway. I went to get some joggers. That's what I was saying. And um, I found these on the rack. 25 quid that was on sale. There was meant to be 50, I think, or 60. And there was 25 quid and I was like, well, I'll get them because I'm cute. Comfy, stretch around the waist, love that. And like really baggy as well. And they've got pockets. Press stud ones, not zips. <laughs> what I actually went for, but I couldn't let the deal pass me by. They're too cute too, you know. And I know that them's something I wear all the time, like the daily, which I have been. <laughs> I've only just come out the wash and I'm back on again. I wanted to check if this was going to be too much green, but because it's a different shade, I think it looks good. What do you think? I love this top, I do. Oh, I mean, I could have done with white ones. I ain't getting no more. But, oh, I really like it. I don't want to get out of this one now, so I'm just going to be walking up and down until I'm fed up with it, which will be never. No, I'm just kidding. But, 
What do we think? Do you think it's too much green? I hope not. I hope you're more like, no, nah, where are we? Because everyone's in matching sets these days. But yeah, they don't really match match. But then I kind of like that. It's like light green, dark green. It matches the strings. Mm, not quite. What do you think? <laughs> okay. I'm very like wild today. What's going on? Or am I always like this? And I'm just more self aware today. I love that these are gonna go with lots of stuff. This is a top from Sheen. Love this jumper. Perfect autumn classic. Something easy to wear. <laughs> if you're on my passes this is the jumper I wanted to try with this dress but I think it's too long for the type of dress that it is unless I like tucked it up nah it's too boxy for it I think but I wanted to try it anyway Because I thought the blues looked nice together, but it's not like cropped enough, and then it would just look too boxy. Gotta try these things. I'd usually wear this with like black jeans, but my black jeans are in my wardrobe, and I couldn't be bothered to get them out, and these. I wanted to show you anyway because they've got like fluff inside and, and they are my go-to autumn and winter leggings they're like really high waist they literally come up to my bottom of my boobs basically but they're nice they're kind of shapely and this is from dolls kill from like years ago but it's still going it's absolutely gorgeous. I love the quality of clothes from Dolls Kill though. It felt instantly warm as soon as I put it on. And it's not even that thick. It's a really good quality jumper. It's one of my favourites. I love it. And I forget how comfortable it is. All year. And then I put it on and I'm like, oh I forgot about this. Every time. Honestly, I'm not even kidding. I put it on just as I was like, oh, I forgot how good that felt. It's so nice. And it ain't the first time I've done it. So there you have it, my autumn collection for this year. Don't know where that accent came from. Um, there's probably more. But we've, going, we've been going on quite a bit, have we? So that's it, my autumn collection. So while I'm here, I'll update you on what's been going on. I went to Rush with my friends, it's a trampolining place. M my life, the aches in my neck the next day, because obviously we was like using the trampolines as you would at school, you know, when you remember, like, do you remember the seat drop and swivel hips and stuff like that? We were messing around doing that and like doing flips and stuff. Couldn't land on my feet, I tried. Um, it's so out of practice, but yeah, we was doing flips and stuff the next day. Like me getting out of bed, I felt like my neck was gonna, was gonna snap. The pain at each side, it kind of felt like you know when you've got swollen glands and you get that pain. It was like that, absolutely mad. I was I've grazed my elbow, I've grazed my back, I grazed my back at um, Ninja Warrior. So I also went to Ninja Warrior. I think I've got a death wish in my thirties or something. I feel like. This year I've just been doing like really adventurous stuff that I should have done as a kid but never really got the chance to. But I'm too old to do it, you know what I mean? I'm going to get hurt. Well anyway, um, yeah I grazed my back at Ninja Warrior because I was running up the... Did you see the slide? You might have seen it on my Instagram. There was a slide, then like there was three, two, two small, well small one, mid middle one and then the highest. I tried the highest, I couldn't get up there. I got the middle one though. But the, um, the small one, it took me like three times before I actually reach the top because it's like you have to do a technique you sort of have to run forward 
and like I would get halfway and then get scared that I was too high so that would make me fall it would make me stop running and um, yeah I finally got to it though thank god uh, and then my hands like we was climbing and stuff it was manic and there was like an inflatable place there as well. I felt like a real kid in there. I loved it. Like you have to run up the slide and well, run up the stairs up to the slide and then slide down. It actually made your stomach turn. Do you think I could still get that at my age? I think it was wuss. Even when I did flips at Rush on the trampoline, um, my stomach was turning. I was like, Dan, did that make your stomach turn? She was like, Yeah, it does. I don't even think Lucy tried to flip. I can't remember. Yeah, I can't remember. I think she did like a gamble because there was like um, hills and you could gamble down the hill. I think she did that. And uh, there was one where you was up in the air and you jumped onto like a floaty. It wasn't really a trampoline. It was like a blow up. I don't know what you'd call them. Like mattress, I guess. A blow up mattress that wasn't so hard. It was just quite soft and plush when you dropped on it. But it was still scary from that height. You know, it wore that high. You think to yourself, just do it. But then when you're up there yourself, you core. It was really odd. Me and Lucy was, had to do it. Well, I did it on my own. But me and Lucy together did it as well. Because Lucy wouldn't do it on her own. Lucy just lands on her feet. I was like, threw myself back. Thinking we'd both land on our back. She lands on her feet. I was like, well... That's took the fun out of me. She was like, yeah, I was too scared. <laughs> so yeah, that's been my adventures. And tonight I'm going rock climbing. <laughs> I swear I've got a death wish. But um, I just like to find new ways of being fit, you know. Sometimes the gym bores me. But I do go. Just, you know, I, I, I like swimming. I feel like that's a fun activity for me. I do really enjoy swimming. But I can't always go. So... Um, I do really enjoy just finding other ways to do sports so tonight we're doing rock climbing <laughs> so I'll let you know where that goes maybe in the next try on or in another month or so <laughs> no I'm just kidding I'll try and keep up with you I say that every time but guys I'm busy I've got so much going on I don't know how I cope but honestly I don't <sighs> anyway yeah so that's my updates um, I hope you lot are doing well. Don't forget to like and subscribe and stay loony. Bye.